morning YouTube so it's a Saturday morning 15th of February beautiful weather oh wait, 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 wait a minute it's not shot Raining, it's windy, storm Dennis can do one. It's blowing a hoolie. And I am just off to West Midlands Motorcycle Centre to pick up my new Triumph Tiger 800 XCX. I was um, showing my wife one of the videos, I can't remember which one it was. I think it's when we went out to Hapney Green Airport and whoever's at the front pointing out again gravel on the road, gravel on the corner, mud on the corner potholes she was like what are you doing? Like you're looking after you after your mates so I'm out on my own today nobody's looking after me apart from me so I know we'll have to get loads of new stickers Got stickers on this one. I'm going to try and peel them off and stick them on the other one. I'm sure um, they'll get rid of them. But I'll definitely need some new stickers. So I'm going to have to tap up some of the YouTubers and see if I can uh, get a new one. I definitely need a new Island Biker one. I haven't yet got a Dad and Mad one. Or mad and dad, I can't remember. Clean your windscreen with like kitchen cleaner. So it's really clean. And then just wipe Rain-X all the way over it. It's particularly in the um, in the winter when it ices up. You'll have no ice on it. Well, it'll put ice on it, but it just brushes off with your fingers. Brilliant. Tips there, brought to you by Ask Steve. <laughs> I do love that man. Oh, say goodbye, baby. Goodbye, baby. Daddy loved you, but he was sacrificed you. That's a nice kit here, actually. Like that. Mm -mm, that's worth a pretty penny. Right, I'm going in. I wonder where mine is. I'll be right there, won't it? Do do do. Do do do. New bike day, new bike day. I think it's out the front. Oh, they put left it in the dry. Quite a nice car, Zaki. Lovely. Oh, there she is. Hello, mate. You're right. Good, good. Yeah, no, it sounds. The weather's shocking anyway, so. All right, so I'll love you and leave you. <coughs> So, I finally have Triumph. The BMW is gone. Oh, it's a faff buying, uh, buying bikes and sorting stuff out. God, it feels high compared to mine. Really high. <laughs> but mind you, sort of felt me like you were sitting in in the bike. This feels like you're sitting on the bike. I may even have to consider dropping the seat to the lower seat height position. So 
weight balance is slightly different. It definitely feels heavier up top. It's got three quarters of a tank of fuel. I could go for miles. So yeah, the um, yeah the weight feels definitely different. It's a, it's a very natural position to ride in because you just lift your feet off the floor and they're on the pegs. It's got, I think it's got a bigger front wheel than the BMW, which I think was probably a 90. I think there's a 21. So it definitely feels a bit slower on the steering. But it's so smooth though. I find you feel it coming right through the seat. Not offensively, but you can definitely feel it. is just super smooth and the seat is so comfy. It doesn't feel that big, it just feels different. Say the sort of weight balance, how high up you are. The bars are they just feel a little bit narrower, but I don't know if that's because they're a little bit higher. So you see a lot of people standing up and riding these and I think I'm probably a bit too tall for that. You know, it's their self-cancelling indicators. Novel. I won't be using the cruise control today. I think I need to uh, get home and have a look for the book. Work out how everything works. So saying that, I work in IT, so a typical trick is mess about with stuff. And you can't get it to work. RTFM. There we go. Oh, a... neutral. Well, that's it, I'm definitely going to have to look in the book. I can't work out what mode's what. Let's turn her off. Actually, don't roll away. There she is, she's a wide boy, girl. Wide. She's a wide boy, wide girl. That thing looks good. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to drop the seat to be honest, just to uh, feel a bit more sat into the bike. So it's got four panniers which look a decent size, should be able to get plenty of sandwiches in those. Deep. I think the pannier bag should fit in there quite nicely. Looks good. I'm hoping. See, it's okay. Whether that screen's going to have to go, I'll have to see whether I can adjust it. So saying that, there wasn't a lot of wind noise. People have complained about these when they said they were like, particularly when they're tall. But the screen's a bit um, not great. Oh, you get a bit of buffeting and a bit of wind noise, but 
I haven't noticed anything but then saying that, I haven't really gone that far, I haven't really gone that quick. So it may be that it just needs like a, a deflector at the top just to lift it over your head. Yeah, it looks good. Plenty of luggage. So I should be able to get everything in the tent. You've got a backrest for the uh, for the pillion. So there she goes. That is my bike. Right, I'm going to get back because it's a bit starting to rain a bit more. And it's getting windy. And I don't want to be out. There you have it, first ride on the new, or well, my new Triumph Tiger. I'm looking forward to doing some good miles on it actually. So there's a couple of things I, I might change, drop the seat down, so I feel a bit more in it, but we'll give that a go and see what we think. As I saw a, um, a review the other day where the bloke was, it was on the lowest and he moved it to the highest and he said it was a lot better, so we'll have to see. So yeah, no, it's, um, all good so far. So I'll love you and I'll leave you there and um, we'll speak to you soon. Stay good, take care and uh, catch you later. Bye bye.